Hello everyone, this is Will. Today we're going to talk about PC interactivity. As the name implies, we're going to interact with your PC using this interactive pen. Basically, we're just going to take the pen and treat it as a wireless mouse. So, as a mouse, you can control and modify the contents on your PC. And there's also Epson Interactive Tools, which provides basic annotation functionality. For PC interactivity, you're going to need to transfer your video or image signal and your interactivity signal. So there's three ways of doing it. One, you can transfer the video or image using an HDMI display port or VGA cable and combine that with a USB for the interactivity. The second option is to, com is to combine both signals, the video and the interactivity in the same USB cable. And the third option is to lose all the cables altogether and go wirelessly, but in order to do that, you're gonna need Epson's EZMP network projection software version 2.81 or later. Let's take a look at option one. The PC is connected and the images are being transmitted by a VGA cable. The interactivity is being transmitted using a USB cable and that's connected to the projector using the control panel. With those two cables connected, you can use the pen as a wireless mouse. Here you can see I can navigate through the website using just the pen. On your right, you'll see EIT uh, toolbar. You get the basic pen settings and then you can also toggle between mouse and pen mode. Earlier, you saw me use it as a mouse. Now, I'm using it as a pen. Another cool feature is the built-in virtual keyboard. It allows you to type in any fields you need. Many people use PowerPoint as their presentation tool. We're going to open a PowerPoint presentation. Now, you can either use EIT to annotate, or if you want to save those annotations onto PowerPoint, then we recommend you use Microsoft Office Ink tools. Just choose the color. You can annotate right onto your presentation. From there, you can save. So that's option one. Option two is basically the same. All of a you have a single USB cable transmitting the image and the interactivity at the same time. Let's go to option three, where we're going to get rid of the cables altogether and go straight for wireless interactivity. So let's look at the wireless option. First thing you need to do is change sources to LAN. Then you're going to connect your computer to that same wireless network. After that, you're going to open Epson's EZMP network software. I'm going to choose the projector and connect. Once you're connected, the display and interactivity will be transferred wirelessly. I can now use the pen as a wireless mouse. Here you see I can open web pages and use the pen as a wireless mouse. So that's PC interactivity. For more information and additional videos, visit our website.